So here I've got a drum overhead mic track. Now overhead mics always capture the entire kit, but a lot of times we really just want the cymbal sounds from these mics. We don't want to hear the kick drum and the low toms and things like that. So we can use a low cut filter to chop all that out. This filter lets you set where the cutoff frequency is, meaning everything below that point is attenuated. Now let's compare the original sound with the filter. Now that's a lot cleaner, and you're really mainly getting cymbals in this track. Much better to work with. Now this filter also allows us to set how quick this cutoff is. This is called a slope, and a sharper slope means it attenuates more drastically. You can see the downward attenuation curve becoming less gradual. Now there's no right way to set this. Just use your ears. Make sure it sounds smooth. Now most analog console EQs don't allow you to change the slope. So you work with what you have. So now that you have the concept of what a low cut filter does, try it on other tracks as well, like vocals, other high frequency instruments. This cleans up all kinds of low end stuff like air conditioning rumble, air noise in the room, traffic, other instruments that are leaking uh, from your microphones. Just make sure you're not cutting into the main sound itself, so keep it kind of low.